We're back with a developing story out of New York involving Prince Harry, Meghan, and her mom. Representatives for the royal couple say they were involved in a near catastrophic car chase by aggressive paparazzi last night. Harry's mother, Princess Diana, died in 1997 following a car chase and crash involving paparazzi. ABC's Morgan Norwood has more. What started as an evening honoring Meghan Markle at a charity gala in New York City ended with what representatives for Prince Harry and Meghan call a near catastrophic two hour car chase. A spokesperson says the couple, along with Meghan's mother, were allegedly pursued by highly aggressive paparazzi in Manhattan last night, accusing the paparazzi of running red lights and even driving on the sidewalk. Chris Sanchez, a member of Harry's security detail who was with the couple during the incident, tells CNN, I have never seen, experienced anything like this. There were about a dozen vehicles, cars, scooters, and bicycles. The public were in jeopardy at several points. It could have been fatal. But in a statement released today, the NYPD says there were numerous photographers that made their transport challenging. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex arrived at their destination, and there were no reported collisions, summonses, injuries, or arrests. The NYPD is also running down reports of some members of the paparazzi having their license plates covered and driving on sidewalks and backwards on streets. Prince Harry, Meghan and her mom had left the Zickville Ballroom where Meghan received the Miss Foundation's Women of Vision Award. The spokesperson for Harry and Meghan said the chase lasted two hours, but the mayor is skeptical. I find it hard to believe, but we will find out the exact duration of it. But if it's a 10 minutes, a 10 minute chase is extremely dangerous in New York City. Prince Harry has been outspoken about the security of his family at times, pointing to similarities between his wife's treatment and the treatment of his mother, Princess Diana. The late Princess of Wales died in 1997 after a high-speed car chase in Paris by paparazzi. It's something we've heard Prince Harry talk about time and time again, his fear of history repeating itself. And obviously this event last night is exactly one of those moments. And so far, neither Buckingham nor Kensington Palace have commented on the incident. I'm Morgan Norwood, ABC News, New York.